what a great turnout we have here in Portadown. I tell you what, it makes you quite proud to be across today. When you see the bands parading and the orange men parading, talk about a culture. There's no culture with touches anywhere in the world. We have a culture next to none. See, Republicans, they haven't got a culture. The only thing they, get, they have is a few gnomes sitting in the garden and a pint of Guinness. The parades. Take a look at the hunger striker parades. They're a sham. Never mind that they're a sham. The reason they're parading is to commemorate boys who starved themselves to death. I tell you what, you go a long way in this field before you would find a mother who would let her son starve to death for some cause. But you don't have to go too far where you can get a mother to tell you about her son or her grandfather or her great-grandfather or whatever fought and died for his country. Not starved himself to death because he was told he'd bring shame onto the Republican cause. We celebrate our culture because we keep winning. The IRA have nothing to celebrate. The 1916 Rising, we were defeated. The hunger strikers, they were starved to death until one mother decided to take uh, Mr. Quinn off it. She couldn't stand by and let him starve himself any longer. Or maybe the smell of Kentucky got them, I don't know. But anyway, our history and our culture is not to be ashamed of. And in fact, we've seen a number of people from the nationalist community, some of them who are ex security forces, standing there today watching the parade and enjoying it. That's the way it should be. The only ones who don't enjoy our parade and our culture is the Republican dirtbags who fear it because they know they'll never defeat us. Why? How can they say they defeat us? Take a look at that field there. Does that look like a defeated people? Tell you. Go to a Republican parade and take a look at the defeated people. Because the IRA has finished their beat. You see the dissidents, the number of bunch of drug dealers, criminals, uh, pedophiles. Look how long on it. There's pedophiles in the IRA still too. You know, so all the pedophiles didn't go across the dissidents. But that's what you're dealing with now. Criminals, drug dealers, pedophiles. They're finished. We've still got something to celebrate and we will be celebrating.